There are numerous Maydays, including the Mayday Tree, Sam Mayday Malone from the TV series Cheers, various works of literature, including a short story by F. Scott Fitzgerald, a comedic play by George Chapman, and a thriller novel by John Summerfield. It's the name of a handful of bands, including this American one and this Taiwanese group. It's Spider-Girl's given name, as well as the villainous character played by Grace Jones in the Bond film A View to Kill. It's the Universal Distress Call, a ghost town in Colorado, and the former name of Croydon University Hospital in South London, England. May Day is also the name given to an annual holiday celebrated in many European cultures dating back to pre-Christian times. Marking the first day of summer, early celebrations were connected to the Festival of Flora, the Roman goddess of flowers. Additionally, May 1st is one of the feast days of English missionary St. Valpurgis, celebrated the evening before with dancing and bonfires. In some northern European countries, including Germany, Valpurgis night is when sorcerers and witches are said to meet. And while May Day celebrations are held in some parts of Canada, they more typically occur over the Victoria Day long weekend, when the weather is likely to be better. The record for the longest-running, uninterrupted string of May Day celebrations belongs to New Westminster, B.C., where they've been crowning May Queen since 1870. More recently, meanwhile, the name May Day has been associated with International Workers' Day, which originated in Chicago in 1886, when an altercation between police and protesters left 11 dead and scores wounded. Although Labor Day is officially celebrated in Canada in September, May Day remains a significant day for shows of trade union and community unity, with such groups as Solidarity Against Austerity organizing marches and demonstrations. And that is what you need to know about May Day.